G'day DIYs, it's Chris O. Uh, I've done the white grout, now I'm just doing the um, the light grey, misty grey it's called. And it complements this tile, like a lot of tiles, it complements so well. But yeah, it's going to be a nice little Hampton ensuite with the VJ board there and a nice little vanity. Lovely. Some painted walls, you know. Yeah, all good. Bit of Groot. Carefully up here so I don't wipe it into my white. My own, uh, the owner was sitting on the bed and <clears throat> he was watching me do the shelf. And he's right at the right height and he said, Chris, I think you might have just rolled that slightly. And I checked it and I said, yes, mate, I have. Let's just take it out. I hadn't uh, noticed it because I hadn't stood stood back and I had a, a slight roll in it but I haven't now that's for sure it was just something that I hadn't picked up right there and then so that's good he did <laughs> No, I'm glad he did, and uh, I didn't notice it. And once I do the floor, I'll um, turn the fan on, start packing up my tools, and that'll be another one done. I do a um, splashback tomorrow. I don't usually do splashbacks; uh, they're too small. I don't, uh, I don't like them. But it was a referral from people that I did there. Uh, it was a large bathroom next door. It was a couple of years ago. And this lady rang me up and said, oh, you did Steve and Tanya's bathroom. Could you do my splashback? So I went around and gave her a price and she said straight away, yeah, of course. I'll pay that willingly. So I said, okay, cool. Uh, it's with a, um, uh, a 15 by 750 tile porcelain 
So yeah. All good. I'll come back to you shortly.